Parents have been urged to allow their children to play in order for them not to miss out on their childhood. This advice was given by a group sharing education and learning for life cell. The program's coordinator, Beji Jide, says the gesture was born out of the group's desire to contribute to the development of the state and the country in general. Earlier, the group had donated play and sporting activities to the children and youth, respectively, in its cultural cohesion and inter-community living program. It's, it's an occasion that centers around building social cohesion and uh, cross-cultural tolerance among the people. And this is very important because if we do not tolerate each other, if we do not respect each other, if we do not honor the humanity of each other, uh, then uh, we will not be able to develop and move forward as a people and as a country. I always want people to understand that uh, uh, humanity comes first before religion. Uh, before you are a Muslim or a Christian, you are first a human being. And therefore, let us learn to go beyond our religions and our tribes and fellowship and relate with each other, respect each other and build each other up. This project has enabled us to see the importance of allowing children to play. Like during the course of the activities, we listened from parents who didn't know the importance of play in the lives of their children. Few months down the line, we returned yesterday and we could hear from parents how their children are positively engaged and how they are able to use their energy positively now. And that is a quite uh, heartwarming for us. We are hoping that as we allow them to continue to live the proceeds of this project, we will see a lot of change and a lot of positive development in the lives of the children and that of everybody in this camp. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.